guy in the camera area and didn't see you over there. Hey guy on the couch. Nobody knows the on the couch. Hello there viewers and thank you for watching Bone Man Rhapsody. And today I have some more very special local rappers here today. I'd like to introduce to you my incredibly awesome uh, co-host Sir Cussalot. Yeah, sluts. Fuck Words yeah. For dinner. Fuck yeah. <laughs> and now, introducing a few local rappers and uh, and and uh, someone else who uh, I, I guess he puts a lot of work in behind the scenes. I'd like to introduce to you uh, uh, Tim Hansen and some local rappers, uh, uh, T per T and Omega. How's it going, guys? Excellent. Goody two shoes. Oh, totally. Uh, I guess the first question for you two on the couch here is, um, how did you get involved in hip hop? You know, that, when did it start for you? Tell them how you feel, T. Well, uh, it started for me back when, um, man, what did it say? Uh, I don't know. I Red man. Muddy Waters, 15, 14, skating. Actually, matter of fact, if you go to Facebook, uh, there's a picture of me rapping when I'm like 15. So all you rappers are like, oh. I did this over 10 years. No, I was really doing it <laughs> back in school. So check that pick out. That's when my that's when the hairline was like right and tight. You know what I'm oh, saying? I'm kind of falling yeah. back now. But <laughs> oh the hairline was like river. right and tight. You know what I'm saying? Looking like LeBron and shit. Oh, yeah. Yeah, a little small for LeBron. But uh, <laughs> me, myself, uh, same thing. Actually, I could tell you where I was at when I fell in love with hip-hop. It was like 1994, in my cousin's house, listening to UGK. Uh, Mama put me out when I was only 14. I heard them words, and I had just got put out. Then after that, I started rapping. My first rap battle at a basketball court in Quincy, Illinois. <laughs> Exciting. Rode by some guys, rapping, jumped out, didn't know what I could do. I won the rap battle. Oh, man. And then from then, it was on. I've really been doing it, like, 15 years. Mm. Like, for real, for real. I started off doing uh, battles at the Shattered, the old Shattered, which is now gone. Big ups, uh, down Rhyme under. I was doing, doing it forever there, was a champ there forever. Any battle in the street I could get into, any place, anywhere, that's where it started for me at freestyling teenage years oh man well that's pretty dope so you guys um i guess you've been around a while um so um i know you're in a group uh that goes by cold cuts right yes as you can see my shirt says the cold cuts we uh make cuts that are chilly we frosty we're comedians man we're stand-up comedians that rap we don't well we make you laugh we make jokes. We just have fun with it. Like, it's really humorous. Oh, that's what it's all about, right? Inappropriate, humorous, you know what I'm saying? Comical, you know what I'm saying? Childish. Reaper induced. Like that, that stuff. And no, uh, we don't smoke reefer abracadabra. 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 <laughs> And well, how about uh, you here? Uh, um, are you an independent artist? Or? I'm an independent artist. I rap alone. I go under the moniker, the OMG. That's the one-man gang. I perform alone besides my DJ. I rap alone. I do it by my damn self. I stand <laughs> up by myself. I fall down by myself. Um, I got the mixtape that just came out. Suddenly, uh, actually, uh, Furious Styles. And I got a record that I'm about to put out, re-release this summer, called SID. Love acronyms. Suddenly I'm dominant. Um, That's pretty dope. And uh, I just, I'm by myself. I'm not in a group. I did some, I did a record with Teep. It's actually pretty fun, a lot of fun. Uh, called The Creeper, Abracadabra. Uh, 
<laughs> and uh, yeah, I mean, I rock by myself. It's what I do. One man game. Oh man, right that's on. me. And uh, well, I guess I'm gonna kick it over here to Tim. Uh, um, so I, I guess you've been doing a lot of things behind the scenes. Uh, you've been organizing all kinds of events. Uh, what other kind of things do you do? Um, let's see, uh, your company here. Uh, 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 let's see, like the syndicate uh, artist management. Yes. Uh, could you tell me, well, and the viewers a little bit more about that? Yeah, absolutely. Well, for me, um, I started into music, um, working as a producer. I was making beats um, roughly about 10 years ago, working with, with this gentleman here and uh, the other half of Cold Cuts, Caper Lucero, um, our homie Ricky Bifford, rest in peace. Um, very quaint setting, one bedroom apartment, Providence Hill, something out of nothing type of stuff. Moved to St. Louis for a while. When I came back uh, to Columbia, I bought a house here and started building up a studio. Um, and whenever I came back, I started working with this guy again, uh, working on his mixtape, Vote Yes, Volume 1. Vote Yes. Um, Vote Yes 2 will be out a couple months. Be looking for that. Um, after we kind of got things rolling, Caber came back into the fold. The album Absolute Zero came after that. Um, and as I started working with more artists locally and just kind of started reestablishing myself here as kind of like, you know, the guy to go to, um, I started doing management for them just because things just started going faster and, um, you know, things just kind of started booming. We did professionally packaged albums, um, you know. Absolute zero. Yeah, it's, you know, it's, it's poly-wrapped, it's, it's spine-labeled, it's barcoded, it's in your, your local store. Um, Excellent. So it, it all kind of started for me with that. From then, um, the studio's expanded. Um, it's my full-time gig, it's what I do. Um, I take care of management for the cold cuts. This gentleman, um, Blake Gardner, who's a local jam artist, Cutler Jones, who's a local producer, um, Aaron Nager of Dexter Beats out of St. Louis, who's done placement for, for this guy. He's got uh, beats on Stevie Stone's new album. Uh, I was working with Strange real close, doing it, doing it real tough. So, um, you know, that's, that's kind of the abbreviated background of you know, my deal and where it comes from. And we do a lot of local shows, a lot of local promotion, help the venues make, you know, hip hop, you know, a booming thing in Columbia. We got a pretty good rep around here for doing good shows and stuff, and that's something I'm pretty proud of. So. Yeah, for sure, yeah. for sure. Well, it looks like, it looks like you got a couple, uh, I got a couple flyers here. Uh, perhaps you guys could talk about some of these events that are coming up real soon here in town. Yeah, I got, um, I'm starting my summer tour, Furious Styles Tour, named after the mixtape. Uh, that starts May 26th, this Saturday, at Mojo's. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I got a local group. I like to call them the New Age Beastie Boys, Triple Crown. They're there, and I got a new artist named TG. He's there. Uh, we'll break that show out Saturday night, followed by June 7th, I believe, in Omaha, Nebraska. We'll be up there. Uh, where we at? Lincoln, sorry, Lincoln, They're making Nebraska. moves, guys. Forgive They're me. making moves. Lincoln, Nebraska, uh, with another one of our artists on Syndicate, uh, three on three, I believe, what they go by. Um, we're going to rock that out, man. I am a real energetic performer, and I plan to give everybody the Omega Influenza, which means <laughs> <laughs> once I spit on you, Ugh. you're all going to catch the virus. So Ugh. that's the plan. He's got cooties. I've got the cooties. <laughs> <laughs> Makes you say shit like that. <laughs> Go crazy. Um, well, we got a little show going uh, July 2nd. Or, sorry, June 9th. Um, June 9th. June 9th. Did I, yeah. And, um, abracadabra. Um, <laughs> it's the Cold Cuts last show in Columbia for a while because we are moving to Cali. I'm going first. I'm parachuting out that bitch. Oh, oh I mean, sorry, out to that piece. Um, oh, you late, can July, you want. late July. Late uh, July. I'm sorry. I thought I was in the radio station, man. You can't cuss the radio <laughs> station. I forget where. Fuck you know, those I guys. Cuss a lot. I know. <laughs> fuck the radio station. The punk fuck ass, bitch ass dudes. I know. You taint. Anyway, stop. Um, 
anyways, um, yeah, moving out to Cali, doing that thing. We, uh, my boy Caper from the Cold Cuts has a, a solo album dropping called Planet of the Capes. That's, that's coming out pretty soon. Awesome. Uh, I got Vote Yes 2 coming out. So remember in your ballot box, vote yes. Vote um, yes. Vote yes. And yeah, I think that's, I think that's, I'm just kind of touching it for now, touching it for the summer. Well, that sounds really exciting. I will, um, I will try to look up, you know, for some updates, you know, to keep the viewers posted on all this, because this is very exciting. You know, you guys are making moves, you know, slowly crawling out of the underground, right? And Columbia's or. under the belly of the beast. <laughs> Let's see here. Um, so, yeah, uh, you guys talked about the next tapes. Uh, you got some albums coming up. Um, Let's see, what else? Um, are you guys working on, say, uh, uh, I guess like a music video or, or anything like that? Uh, Man, I got probably some ideas for some videos. Uh, the, my video right now on YouTube, Cold Cuts, is uh, THC. Just dropped by that boy Steady on Tetrahydrocannabinol. Cannabinol. Tetrahydrocannabinol, all the, also known as Abracadabra. Abracadabra B. Um, yeah, but um, yeah, we definitely have some plans in the future. Uh, we got some, some definitely new uh, clothing line coming out. Oh, you exciting. Know, you know, Cold Cuts keeps it popping with the little shirts. And Fresh. The, oh, yes. Uh, and holler at us. At our shows, got USBs with everything on them, like a little USB with everything that we've ever did. So that's the new joint. Wow! You don't need CDs. That shit's for that's a great your, idea. for your grandpa. The go go go! Give your CD trash. to a grandpa and come pick up my USB. Yada die. Wow! Yada I don't think I've ever heard of that before. Flash treasure chest. That's a great idea. Yes. Yes. As well as myself, man. I don't really, I don't have any videos in the future, man. But I'm really trying to go back to spread that Omega influenza. Like I said, I like to keep it live on the stage. Raw. I like to take this uh, summer tour and expand it until everybody gets so sick that I have to keep them sick, spread a new virus. Um, performing is what I do. Performing is what I love. Performing is what we're going to keep doing. And we'll take this tour and we'll flip it over into working on a new project. Me and Heezer will come up with something in the brew pot. Until then, I probably got good 150 songs for you guys to check out. Uh, Boom. You can go check me out Pow. at um, O period M period G at bandcamp.com. Check yes, me sir. out at OMG underscore Omega on Facebook. You guys need to pick up that mixtape, Furious Styles. It is for free download. Got Stevie Stone on it, Spade Ripper on it. Do that. Uh, hell, I've got, what? Everybody's on that thing. It's, that. it's going crazy. The album is going crazy as well. We got a check. Joel and Benji Madden from Good Charlotte on there. Uh, John Cena, WWE champ on there. What? We're going bananas. Yeah. We're going bananas. That's that right. is bananas. We're going bananas. I've done a lot in my day. I am making a research. I'm the old man that's returning. The old, young, he's the old young man. The old young man. I have no grays yet. <laughs> well, I, re I really like what I'm hearing. It sounds like you guys are real busy, and uh, you guys really need to keep up the good work. Thank you, sir. I really appreciate uh, y'all making an appearance on the show. Oh, yeah. And, it, and it's honestly my pleasure to help, uh, to help let promote let, uh, anything that's going on here in Columbia. So, uh, oh, uh, well, hey, man, Columbia needs more people like you, man, because, yeah. like I said, this is the underbelly of the beast. It's hard to swim here, all right, people? It's very hard to swim here. Keep your head above water in the music industry. So... Go to your local shows, support your local venues, support your local artists, keep spending. It's okay to be friendly in hip-hop, too, okay. man. Everybody wants to be the best, and they think they can't be friendly while trying to be the best. You can be my friend. Get them, T. All night and again. <laughs> you can clown around. Sing it, T. You don't have to be down. Be my you friend. Be a clown. Get Girls, make them go down. Right. You don't have to be so tough, all right? You don't have to be so tough. You don't tough. have to be so tough. Don't flex your chest so much. Well, thank you very much for coming on the show. Hey, man, we appreciate it. Yes, you guys yes, rule. Sir. Yes, thank you, sir.